Hello everyone and welcome back to the Devolution Studio. My name is Yen. I'm here with Jenny. Yeah, I'm back for another one, guys. That's right. And uh, you know what? We have a great video for you today, okay? Yeah. In fact, um, October is a great month here at Devolutions because we Amazing. have all of our products uh, for the next year are released around this time. And we have major releases coming in every single area, in every single product category. And today we wanted to talk a little bit about one of our flagship products, Remote Desktop Manager. Lots of things coming down the pipe. So uh, let's talk a little about Jenny, about what are some things, uh, what have you brought us today? Okay, well, what I want to talk about is like my top 10 favorite feature that RDM 14 is coming out with. Uh, so as Jan just mentioned, it's coming out like this week. So we're super excited and we want to chit chat a little bit about those amazing feature. Sure. So I, I was looking through your notes a little bit oh, earlier. Oh, you were. Yeah, I'm sorry. You were. Go but, ahead. Uh, but uh, <laughs> apparently there's a blog coming out with this too, right? There is. There is, guys. One coming out this Thursday. What we wanted to, what I noticed is you had a top 10 list of things that you wanted to talk about. So yeah. let's, let's talk a little bit or let's let you talk about a little bit about what are some of your sure. favorite things that uh, you're looking forward to in this version. It so is, it's like a top 10, yes. so starting with a 10 and number one is my favorite. First of all, okay, so um, you mentioned one password OP Vault support. So yeah. talk to me a little bit about that. Okay, so we had like a lot of requests about OP Vault support because what happened is that one password uh, made a new uh, file type. So if you were okay. using local file with one password, sure. it wouldn't work anymore with RDM when you try to like go and get access to your one password vault. Okay, and that's not good. That's not good, <laughs> that's not good. Yeah. So we put our genius to the job and now they came out and fixed it. So we now have uh, support for uh, OP uh, vault extension. So there's no more problem. That's great. So, so that's cool. now we have one password. So a lot of these things are feature requests that you guys have put in. So yeah. uh, keep those coming on our, on our, on our forum. Um, but uh, all right, so one password OP vault. What about, uh, okay, the next one you have here is some more password safe by Mateso. Uh, yeah. So uh, what do we do? What do we do with that? Okay, so Mateso is a password manager uh, that started in Germany in the early uh, '90s and is super popular with our German and Europe clientele. Uh, we didn't use to support it. Yeah. We had a few requests, so we now have a password safe by Mateso integration in RDM. So now they can use their their password safe. Uh, for managing their passwords, but they can integrate it with RDM to get all the, the wonderful tools that we provide. Exactly, so they that's can really keep good. one of their favorite tool and just put it with RDM and yeah. have an amazing tool. And that's the beauty of RDM, because yeah. we, we take all of your favorite connections, over 150 of them, right? Yeah. And then we, we <laughs> connect crazy. them all into one window pane of glass so that you guys can be expert yeah. power users. Uh, and that's why, that's why we have all these for you. Uh, okay, next one, Google Drive, what's going on there? Okay, well, we now have a Google Drive data source. So simply you can create a new data source and it points directly to Google Drive. Um, okay, what about uh, to execute permissions? What is this? Okay, so you know how in RDM uh, for permissions, like you have permissions uh, set on your entry. So you have to give permission to your user to uh, read, view, delete, uh, see password. Sure. Well, we added one more so you can really like decide the permission you're giving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the one we added was execute and the execute permission will allow your user to actually open your entry. Exactly. Good, uh, this is good. Uh, what about, uh, what did we do with the repositories? Enhanced so, yeah, okay, I know, good. a little bit of repository enhancement, worked a little bit on it. Uh, we added users and roles. So now when you create your repository, you can actually add your user and your role directly on your repository. Oh, that's Like so cool. before you had to create it and then you had sure. to go and add your user. Now you can just all do it in one swoop. Man, it makes it so much easier. That's so great. So much easier. I love it, love it. Good. Uh, okay, what about some feature improvement with uh, MySQL? Okay, so MySQL, what we want to do with MySQL is actually uh, enhance it and improve it to give all the same feature that we have with like SQL Server. Sure, sure. We want to do the same thing with MySQL and actually as a little bonus, we're also going to do it with uh, MariaDB. At the moment, they added repository, documentation and uh, favorites. Developers, once again, man, they did a great job trying to integrate all that stuff. I know. They're magicians back there. Really? Uh, oh, we have little Harry Potters that, it, It's so true. <laughs> They're so, so good. Okay, uh, number two. We've got two more features. Two number more two features. is 
Uh, SQL Azure MFA support. Okay, Big one. that one too, guys. It's a huge one. And once again, I'm just going to say like two lines on it sure, because sure. once again, your team is going to jump on this and I'm sure it's going to have a big video on it. Yep. Uh, this is Microsoft has introduced a new Azure AD interactive authentication with MFA. Yeah. Uh, now, our guys had to work hard to <laughs> integrate all of that <laughs> sure, with sure. RDM also. Uh, so it's really so you can authenticate with MFA directly at the data source when using an SQL Azure. OK, the last one. This one, this is great. This goes back to like my gaming days. I've been <laughs> I've been pwned. Who pwned me? So what is what is I've been pwned? What is okay, this whole so thing? Okay, so I've been pwned technically is a, a, a website that okay. has a list of over fifty five million uh, password email address sure. that has been stolen that has been hacked at some moment. Okay, uh, you know when like Yahoo was hacked, like all yes. the information they had, they bundle all of that. And what we do now is when you're going to enter a password, it will check in that list if that password has been pawned before. Okay. So they might say, hey, wait a minute, that password has been pawned before. So yeah, use sure, another sure. one maybe. That's and amazing. And then yeah. use another one. So it's really cool. I'm going to do a little blog on that one too. That's going to be cool. Yeah, yeah. In fact, I think you can go on their website, right? And exactly. put your email in and yeah. see if your email was on one of those uh, yeah. lists that was opened by hackers. So security is in mind here. And our yeah. team's all, always working on the improving our security. They are working um, hard. So that's it. Top 10? Top 10. That that's was my great. top 10, guys. Seriously. It's that's been awesome. Fun. I love it. So, hey, uh, as you guys are YouTube watchers, make sure you subscribe. Uh, keep in, in touch with us. You know, on our website, we're going to put um, on our YouTube channel, we always have a playlist. We're going to do a what's new in RDM 14. So, all the things that she talked about, we're going to break those down a little bit more in detail. And that'll be coming in the next few weeks. And uh, But make sure you subscribe. Follow us on our, our, our social media channels as well. Yeah. And where can we get uh, RDM 14 if they want to get a free trial? Maybe they haven't used it yet. Right now, just go on devolutions.net and you got a free trial there waiting for you. And we're more than happy to answer any and all questions that you have. And really don't hesitate to like, you know, ask us some question. You want sure. some details more about one feature than another. We're always there to help. I'm, well, I'm excited about using it and uh, I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So have a great day, guys. Awesome. Thank you. Cheers, guys. Bye.